Mandela of Church Party leader Alfred Mutua has challenged Wiper Party leader Kalonzo Musioka to exit the national political scene and give way for young and visionary leaders to rescue the Kamba nation, saying that his time is over. Mariam Jahid with the story. Reaction still linger after Waipa Party candidate Eshio Mwaiwa thrashed to position three in the just concluded by election in Gumasumba, a move that has invoked leaders from the region to question his influence in the region. Everything in life has an expiry date. Even medicines have an use by date. The time has expired for Stephen Kalonzo Musyoka. And you cannot purport to continue saying that you are the leader of Ukambani. The times have shifted. Machakos County Governor Alfred Mutua has declared that it's time for Kamba Nation to have a new political leader. As Kalonzo Musyoka has been focusing on power, positions, disruptions and waging the tribal card for himself and very little for the people who have kept him at the national table. Our people are crying out for jobs, our people want water, our people want roads, our people want development. But Stephen Kalonzo Musyoka, for those 36 years, he has been concentrating on amassing power for himself and taking care of his immediate family and people who are close to him, but not the general people. Because he's used the old principle that as long as people remain poor and ignorant, they'll still think that he is the master and is the one who will be the savior. Meanwhile, Kangundo MP Muli Fabian have called all Ukambani presidential aspirants to form coalition together to have one voice so Ukambani community can get a bigger share in the national cake. We have to announce that 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 we have to Machakos Governor Alfred Mutua, his counterpart Kivuda Kibwana and Waipa Beti leader Kalonzo Musioka declared they will be on the race for the country's top job come 2022. Mariam Jahid reporting from Switch TV.